Well, welcome back everyone to this edition of Convention Chat. My name is Mike Bird. I am the current treasurer for the Utah Republican Party. And today we're excited to welcome our UTGOP candidate for state party treasurer, Olivia Dunn. Hi. <laughs> we're glad to have you today. How are you doing? I'm pretty good. Um, it's busy as always, but doing really well. Good. Well, yeah. it's pretty pretty rough weather, so we're glad yes. you were able to, to yeah. join us today. And, <laughs> Um, tell us, actually tell, tell them, tell everybody that's watching today a little bit about yourself. Yeah, um, I am, fun fact for you is I am the oldest of 10 kids. Um, there's no twins, they're all born to the same parents, no adoptions, nothing like that. So I just have a really large family and I've been very privileged with that. I jokingly say I've been a mom since I was two. Um, and I have been politically involved for a very, very long time. My mom homeschooled all the kids and was getting her master's degree at the same time. And so she was studying political economics. And so I sat there and would just listen to her read out loud and got very, very passionate about politics. Um, at the age of 12, I had the privilege of going to the Capitol and, and starting to learn about the lawmaking process. And, and I feel like over the years, I've been there every year since I was 12 and I'm now 29. So that's a lot of years in, in learning how Utah politics work. and. Um, that's been, that's been a lot of fun. And then I, when I was, before I even turned 18, the caucuses were before I turned 18, I got to go and attend my first caucus. Um, I was, uh, nominated to be a delegate and have pretty much been hooked ever since. It's, I love the party. I love our platform and it's been so awesome. Um, one of my favorite things that I've done recently is starting to attend the state central committee meetings. They're open meetings and I'm not a member, but for the last four years, I can proudly claim 100% attendance. And, and I, I feel like it's so important, not just to know how the state of Utah runs as I've been able to do with the legislature, but also to know how the party runs. And that's something that's very important to me. Yeah, well, appreciate that. And you sharing that with us. Sounds like you've, you've had a lot of experience Kind of in the the party and political arena so why why a secretary why uh why are you wanting to to do this well i i'm i decided to try and run for this position for two reasons the first one being because i am like i said very passionate about the party i plan um on lifting wherever i stand that's the principle that I, i'm very firm in and i feel like i've been able to show that over over a decade of faithful republican service um, having been the chair of the fundraising committee in Davis County, being a delegate in both county and state. I've worked with the teenage Republicans, college Republicans. I've worked on many campaigns. I've been both integral in party politics as well as outside just in the political arena in general. And so I decided that this was something where, where I was qualified. I knew I was going to serve in some capacity. And so I decided to run because I feel like I can make a positive difference here. And then the second reason why I decided to run is simply because, and no offense to you, but um, I feel like it's very important that no candidate feels so secure in their election that they're able to just swing into another term without a challenger. And so because I am qualified for this specific position, having served as the assistant to the secretary in Davis County and done other secretarial work throughout the years, that I, I it was worth putting my name in the name in the ring. Yeah. So what would you like to accomplish as secretary these next couple of years? You know, that's such a like big question, but it's something that I get so excited about. One of the big roles of the, the secretary is to be a point of contact for membership within the Republican Party across the state, which means that you get to interact with people all over the place. And I love that. I'm definitely a people person. I feel like I can work well with individuals and that's something that excites me. I am so passionate about our platform. Um, things that we stand for that unite us all. But that's the thing that's so cool about any political party is that we have a platform that then is the ideas, the values, and the principles that we that we all hold sacred. You know, they're they're dear, they're important, they're they're integral to the way that we live our lives, and our platform is so cool. I mean. Some of the things on there are, we believe in the proper role of government. We believe in ethical, honest, moral um, elected officials. 
we we want to be able to see the the rights of religion not infringed which is so important as we've seen with all the shutdowns there have been a lot of people saying that that is an infringement um, and so that's something where where it, it, those are those are values and principles that we hold so dear and I feel like the Republican Party has been slandered in the news in media there's so many people who are hating on the Republican Party or maybe people within the party and and really what unites us all is that platform and so being able to interact with membership across the state that's something that we can work and do a lot of education on so I look forward to being the secretary and and putting those plans in place and working with our new leadership and in the things that will help us be able to educate and and, and provide excitement for our platform yeah <clears throat> well thank you we we're, we're running short on time but you know in, in you, you get an opportunity to address the delegates today yeah um, and um, you know if you were to give a, a 30 second elevator speech for why the delegates should vote for you you do have a challenger um, why what would that be and, and why should they vote for you um, well I'm gonna talk straight to you guys since you're here um, I am a very very passionate person I've proven that over a decade of service within the Republican Party like I've said I am qualified for this position having worked in many different places I have proven that I am willing to work fairly and honestly with people whether or not we see eye to eye in opinion I am so excited to be able to lift where we serve like I said I have 100% attendance to the meetings that I am, I am supposed to attend, as well as the State Central Committee, where I'm not supposed to attend, but it's just something that's very exciting to me. And I, am, I, I truly believe that I am qualified for this position and, and very excited to be able to get involved. Well, thank you, and we appreciate you joining us today and, and joining those that are watching. Um, we're, we look forward, there's a lot of work to be done before our May 1st convention, and we wish you the best of luck. Thank you everyone for joining us today.